Hey everybody, welcome back to Heat My Shorts. We are on episode 18 of Flying Across Canada, so I'm going to have a seat in my little chair here and tell you what's going on. <clears throat> We're at Athabasca Regional Airport today. Charlie Yankee Whiskey Mike is the airport designation there. Today we're in an Air Creation Tenarg 912 Ultralight Trike. I'll show you what it looks like from the outside here. It's a pretty cool little trike for sure. It's a two-seater. We do have a passenger with us. Um, Maggie's with us too. You just can't see her. <laughs> uh, we're going to be heading... Bring up our map here. There we are, heading 21 nautical miles southeast, arriving at Boyle Airport, and the designation there is Charlie Foxtrot Mike 7, and it's an estimated 20 minute flight time. So, I'll get snugged into my chair here and release our parking brake and power up. I guess we'll get our map out of the way there. We'll bring it back up once we're in the air there. Let's power up. Hope you're all having a good day. It's been a, yeah, it's been a good day here for sure. Actually, I'm gonna poke my head. There we go. And rotate. There we are, we are up. And we do not have any landing gear to retract or anything like that. This is a very simple aircraft. There's no flaps. There's no headlights or electronics. Well, I guess there's electronics as a battery, but no, no air conditioning or heating. That's for sure. <laughs> so we'll just get our our heading aligned. There we go, more or less right. There we go. All right. Maybe a little bit more. Yeah, we can basically close that now. now let's check out the outside view. Bring our camera out a little bit for a little bit better of a view. And here we are. There's our airport we just took off from, Athabasca Regional Airport. So it seems our air quality is uh, being impacted by the fires nearby. We kind of know it was only a matter of time. We've been very lucky so far, but it is a little bit smoky out there today. I'm definitely not complaining. I'm just, just letting you know. We'll head back to the inside here. I want to tell you a little bit about this aircraft. I actually don't know too much about it. I couldn't find a whole lot out about this little aircraft. This is an Air Creation Tenarg 912 Ultralight Trike. They've been in production since the year 2013 and they are originating from the country of France. They're now, I guess they're produced in other places as well, but that's where they originated from. And that's really all I know about it. Seems a little windy up here today. Definitely kicking us around a little bit. Yeah, you can see right there, it's a very, <laughs> very simple dash on this thing. It's got a QR code on the dash there. That's hilarious. Whoop. Okay, we're good. 
<laughs> There's a little QR code there. Interesting. Yeah, so just a nice chill flight today. Something a lot slower. Something more relaxing. Do a little bit of sightseeing over the farmlands of Alberta. I'm sure there's a lot of them here, but this is some of them. In between Athabasca and Boyle Airport. Episode 18 today. Pretty awesome. It's quite a few episodes. But I'm really enjoying this. I'm kind of purposely zigzagging through the country, through the different provinces. Just to see more of the country and enjoy it a little bit more, make it last longer. Because I guess once it's over, we'll just pick another country and fly across another country. I don't know. It'll be weird when we're all done with this series. So we're about a third of the way through our journey now. Oops, wrong button. I seem to remember, I did actually do a test flight of this one, and I think the, the destination airport, it may have been a gravel airstrip. I forget now, but that, something in my mind is telling me that it was. I don't know. Hi, Maggie. What's up? You're a good girl. Yeah, it's a pretty cool little ultralight for sure. It's definitely a good learner aircraft, I, I would say, because there's not a lot that you need to think about aside from, you know, the obvious major stuff like staying airborne and not crashing, but not a lot of additional devices and technology to have to worry about. I suppose we could fly, fly a little bit lower. Get a look at these fields and whatnot. A little motor on the back. Almost looks like a little like air compressor or something. Well, I guess in a sense it compresses air, but. <laughs> oh, we're getting a little bit off course here. I'm actually not too far off from our airstrip. Let's actually check what kind of a... Well, we might not actually be able to see it yet. Luckily, I actually... Oh, I just dropped my phone. Good thing I didn't fall out of the ultralight. <laughs> I did take a picture of the orientation of the airport. Not a very good picture of it. Oh, there we go. Okay. Actually, I'm kind of, kind of in line with the... with the airstrip, I think. If I turn in now, I should be basically in line with it. I don't see it yet. How far are we away? Yeah, not too terribly far away.
It's actually kind of difficult to spot an airstrip from straight on. And I do have name tags and everything turned off right now. Actually, it probably does show the fields and whatnot, um, but that doesn't really help me too much, I suppose. <laughs> that could be it, just off to the left there. Right here, that could be it. That could also be it right there. No, we're too close for that. I think that's it in the in the trees there. Yeah, I think so. Whoops. Alright, let's get ready for landing here, because I think that's it. Yeah, totally. I think so. I'm not very experienced with this aircraft, to be honest, so hopefully we have a nice landing here. Yeah, just a grass runway. Landing in a little bit of a crab there. Not exactly ideal, but that's okay. Not bad, not terrible. Yeah, this does look familiar. I have parked here before. I'm not sure where you're actually supposed to park, but this is where I parked last time. <laughs> so I imagine we passed our 22 minute mark or whatever. Probably have to do a little bit of editing. Especially once we have our hangout with Maggie, I suppose. There we go. Let's shut it down here. Well, this has only been a 14 minute flight. That's a very quick one. That's alright too. I am okay with that. So, throttles at zero. Magneto off, battery off. And I think that is everything. Parking brake is on. We're done. We are here at Boyle Airport, Charlie Foxtrot Mike 7 in our Tenard 912 Ultralight Trike. Just a nice quick flight this time. Actually, I guess we call them all quick flights, don't we? <laughs> there we go. Well, 
I suppose the only thing left to do then is have a little hangout with this dog. There we are. Oh, better unplug the camera first before I pick it up. <laughs> Let's see what she's doing. Let's see what she's doing. What's she doing? What is she doing? You got a hairball in your mouth. You got a hairball in your mouth. What a cute little dog. What a cute little dog. Eh? Oh, what a good doggy. Yes. You did so good at co-piloting, Maggie. You did such a good job. What a good girl. Can I have a high five? Good girl, Maggie. Oh, I don't know if you even saw that. I'm really bad for distracting the camera when I'm <laughs> paying attention to Maggie. She's a good girl. I, I like to pay attention to Maggie. <laughs> um, she definitely absorbs my attention. So anyways, I hope you've enjoyed this flight. Definitely a quicker one today. Just pulling up on 16 minutes. Well, just passing 16 minutes now. Um, next time we'll do episode 19. And I actually do have a few of our next destinations planned out now. So I'm not just flying by the seat of my shorts. <laughs> but anyways, uh, I hope you've enjoyed this. In this corner, you'll see our Heat My Shorts logo. In this corner, Sim Famous. Hop over to Sim Famous's YouTube channel if you haven't already. Give him a subscribe and check out his content. Up here, some stuff for you to enjoy. Have a great day. I love you all, and we will hang out again soon. I promise. This has been Heat My Shorts with Maggie and Steve. The Maggie Show. Bye-bye.